legal document that you sign that gives another person the legal authority to make financial and uh, legal decisions on your behalf if you're not able to do so. So typical powers that are given in a power of attorney are the authority to cash checks, pay bills, access accounts, um, sell real estate if necessary, access retirement accounts, and things like that. When you're drafting your power of attorney, you will decide how much authority and what powers you want to give to that other person. Um, it's important to note that a power of attorney is only effective while you're alive. It has no legal effect once you pass away. A power of attorney is an important part of a basic estate plan because without it, if you become incapacitated or incompetent and someone needs to be able to act legally on your behalf, they're not going to be able to do so unless they go to the court and get a conservatorship, which is a very lengthy and time-consuming process. Finally, it's important for estate planning purposes to make sure that your power of attorney is durable which means that it continues to be effective even if you become incapacitated or incompetent.